Hi there, my name is Joe Hanna. I'm a USA Roller Sports Elite Level Coach as well as the Indoor Inline Speed Skating Manager for the World Skate Federation, overlooking indoor speed skating around the world. Today I'm here to talk to you about an area of skating that relates to both indoor and outdoor and is an extremely important piece to the puzzle if you're going to be a competitive roller skater, that is. It's called dry land training. What exactly is dry land training? Dry land training is often referred to by most as strength and conditioning. The intended purpose is to increase strength, flexibility, and overall physical mobility. In inline speed skating, it's actually broken down even more to develop proper technique. Proper technique can be developed by utilizing skate-specific drills. Skate-specific drills are drills that simulate the way we skate and all the movements related to it. Now, dry land training can be done indoors, outdoors, by the beach, or in a park. This is the beauty of dry land training. Rain or shine, there's always the time. There are many drills, as you can see here, that are good for all ages and levels. Pick out drills that you can relate and explain how they correlate to speed skating program that you have in place. Make sure that each drill is explained thoroughly and why they are doing it, how it correlates to the program they are doing as well. I always preach style over speed. Style over speed makes sense and make sure they are doing all their drills correctly. Make sure they do everything starting and finishing perfect. That way, always your technique takes over. Whatever dry land drills you pick out, you can be assured that your students will benefit. If you need help putting together a dry land program, feel free to contact me at any time and I'll be happy to help you. Meanwhile, good luck and happy skating.